Good morning. Dinger in the house. Tuesday PE class, folks. Who's checking in today? Fitbit catching kitty. Oatmeal. Toast for breakfast. All right. Got to do some homework. I see you. Tune in next time. Maybe we'll see you at the sand lot. We are live on Instagram now as well. Wow. Who else is checking in? Judge Jr., ready to go. Soto, Fruit Loops, double bicep salute. Welcome to Tuesday PE class. I think music, sports, and food brings everybody together. All nationalities, all languages, all cultures. Music, sports, food just makes sense. An Uber driver once told me that, actually, in Cleveland, Ohio. He said, the three things that bring everybody together is art, sports, and food. And it makes a lot of sense. Thank you, my mom and dad in North Carolina. I think that uh, we got some good drum beats going. Danny Hughes in the house. Jimmy Bopp in the house. Welcome, everybody who's checking in to our morning PE class. We're going to go uh, 60 more seconds. Go tell a few friends to join us today. It's going to be an epic, epic day of PE. Baby ball game. Is it going to be an epic day? She's got peanut butter all over her face, and her hair is all over the place because she just woke up and had peanut butter toast. Hey, Jake. Hey, everybody. Hey, say have a good PE class. <laughs> she a little shy. All right. Hey, 30 more seconds. Go invite some people. Let's uh, let's have some fun today. Get your friends to show up. Maybe your brother, your sister. Um, 30 more seconds of some drum beats, and then we'll get started here. The shirt's untucked. No, no, that's looking funky. 
running around the bases just like a spider monkey with the average eye contact, just not acceptable. Vintage ball cards, they're going to be collectible. To have some real fun, you don't need approval. If you're sliding with the wrong leg, it's going to be brutal. Tall glass of milk with the vitamin D. Got to hit you a tater deep in the cheap seats. Here's what they're saying when you're running and you're playing and you're running and you're playing with some dirt on your shirt. Don't forget, crack the sunflower seed, you get a groovy little nickname and a Band-Aid on your knee. So trim that nose hair and check for the fuzz. I black salute because that's what a ball player does. Yo! Let's crank it up. Three claps. One, two, three. Arms high. Shirts tucked in. Snip your armpits. Mmm, my armpits smell like respect. Hmm. The smell of respect. And a little bit of peanut butter. Touch your toes. Don't pick your nose. You don't want to pick your nose while you're touching your toes. Mark Twain said that. Spread them out wide. Sniff your left patella. Soto, what's your left kneecap smell like? Jake Nadeau. Mom, Dad, Fitbit, Catching Kitty. Pirate. Penguin. Firestones. What does your left knee smell like? Switch. What about you, Knott's Berry Farm? Sniff that right knee. And side to side. Wherever you may be, California, North Carolina, Missouri, Washington, New York, Florida, you're all over the place. Texas, Omaha, Nebraska, go side to side. Some of you are watching this uh, late at night on my YouTube channel, watching the replay. One, two, three. 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 On the beach, butterflies. Has anybody invited a friend? Hey, come in here to the living room and do some stretching. We're going to work out, play some music, dance a little bit, and act like our favorite animal. We got a lot to do today, folks. Got some brand new drills for you. Spread them out wide. Touch your left phalange. Welcome to the Tuesday morning PE class. Tuesday afternoon on the East Coast. And if you're in London, it's Tuesday night. Switch! Speaking of Tuesday night, guess what's happening tonight? Me and the voice of Fox Sports. He calls football games on Fox. He works with A-Rod and Big Poppy on Fox Baseball. Kevin Burkhart is joining me for Tuesday Trivia tonight. <laughs> Let's give Kevin Burkhart an attaboy, one, two, three. Attaboy! He lives uh, in Manhattan Beach, California, but we're going Instagram Live at 5.30 Pacific, 8.30 Eastern Trivia Contest. And the winner of tonight's Trivia Contest gets to co-host with me next Tuesday. Wow! Touch both phalanges. Raise your hand if you'll be there. There's going to be all sorts of baseball questions. Pretty cool. Left leg out, right foot across. The modeling pose. Twist and look behind you. The weather is here, and it is beautiful. If your back pops, say, oh, my Lanta. Oh, baby ball game just said, oh, my Lanta. Hug that knee into the chest and say, I love you, knee. It's important that we love our knee and our elbow and our feet. Switch. Twist. And then hug that knee into the chest. Say, I love you too. That's it. By now, my neighbors know to shut their windows and put their earmuffs on at 9 a.m. Pacific. They think I'm nuts, but that's okay. I'd rather be nuts than some other things. Downward facing dog.
And upward facing dog, bark like a dog. Five, switch, kick, two, three, four, five. Nice, up on your feet just like that, run in place. Hustle salute. Hustle salute just like that. Freeze. Faster. Freeze. Faster. Freeze. Faster. Checking in, so is Puppy Pro. Rhyme man in the house. The Olafants are rocking and rolling. They'll be at the tribute tonight. Love it. Go backwards. Hug yourself. That's it. Flamingo stretch. Way to go, everybody. Come on in. We're starting to we're starting to see the numbers rise here at PE class. Welcome to the best day of your life. Get that other leg going. Go right hand to the left foot. Across and up. Across. Alternate. Three. Four. A little faster. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Very good. Ten jumping jacks. All together. On your marks. Get set. Go. Attaboy fireball. It's a beautiful day. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we're just going 60 seconds of a free run. 50 plus 10 equals 60. 60 seconds of a free run. On your marks, get set, go. Jog around the backyard. Jog in place. Jog up and down your stairs. Just make sure your shirt's tucked in. Play ball is in the house. I black salute to play ball. I ran some camps with them last summer, and they are epic. Good to see you. We were going to run some more camps this year, but we'll just see when this quarantine gets over with. Until then, here we are. Keep running in place or run around your couch in your living room. Just run. Run like the wind blows. How's the YouTube feed, guys? YouTube okay? Very good. Soto's running around the house. 10 seconds remaining. If you're running in place, get those knees up good and high and stop. Water break. Drink some water. Super Henry's in the house. Way to go. So far, who do we have? We got Ryan Man, Nolan Ryan Jr., Fireball, Puppy Pro, Catching Kitty. We've got Fitbit, Soto, my mom and dad, Speedy, Super Henry, Judge Jr., Lando, who else is in the house? Check in with your nickname. <sighs> YouTube is A-OK, -okay, says Frank Stokes. Good. Now, you might notice I've got 10 cones in a straight line. If you have cones, set up 10 of them. Gene Carlos Stanton's in the house, bicep salute. 10 cones. If you don't have cones, maybe socks or pieces of paper. All right. And what we're going to be doing is some agility skills. We're going to run around the first cone and then run through, run through, 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 just like that. It's called the zigzag. OK, so I want to give you guys a few more minutes or uh, seconds to set that up. Ten cones. And let me know what you're using. Are you using cones? Are you using socks? Are you using pieces of paper? Pickle and Penguin are in the house. Speedy is in the house. Firestones are here. You guys got 10 set up? Well, let's do our first set, folks. First set. So we're here, we're right here at the end. And just follow me, guys. Zigzag, next comb, zigzag. Quick as you can, stay on your toes like a mongoose, like a quick mongoose. And then 10 jumping jacks. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. And now you've got 10 body squats. Body squat, nine, eight, 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. And now we take a 20 second water break. Nolan Ryan Jr. is using socks. Speedy is using cones. Fitbit and Kitty using cones. I love it. Super Henry's using wooden train tracks. Scholar salute. Eye black salute. Mustache salute. Beard salute. Bounce back salute. Scholar salute. Sportsmanship salute. All right, we're going to do that again. Soto's using socks. Lando's using cones. Back to the start. Man, it feels good today. Wow. All right, on your marks. Get set. Zigzag. 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 Ten jumping jacks. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Body squats. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Good job, you guys, telling your friends about class. The numbers are up. It's about 50 people tuning in right now. This time next week, 250 people will be tuning in. They should anyway, if they want to be a ball player. Water break after that set. And we're going three sets of that right there. So we got one to go. Jimmy Bop using a bowling ball and some bowling pins. Love it. What's that nickname again, Jimmy Bop? For, uh, for me as a coach, very important that I get to know everybody's nickname. That lets me know what type of person you are. What do you love to do? Sportsmanship salute from the Jones family in Indianapolis. Round of applause. Once I know your nickname and I know what you love to do, then I kind of know how to coach you. But I can't coach you unless I know you. Last set. Back to the start. On your marks, get set, go. Zigzag, zigzag, zigzag. Hoop, hee, ha. Yes, yes, yes. Ten jumping jacks. Who can do it faster than Coach Ball Game? Can you beat me? Can you do it? And ten body squats. Ten, nine. Come on, Super Henry. Penguin, pickle, Nolan Ryan Jr., Soto. Speedy, Lando, and water break. Very nice. Jake, Puppy Pro, Fireball, Ryman, Pete Alonzo, Judge Jr. I love it. I think I tied. I think I tied with uh, Firestones and Ryman. Trivia tonight, Jake, 5.30 Pacific, 8.30 Eastern, with the one and only Kevin Burkhart. He calls football games for Fox. He calls baseball with A-Rod and Big Poppy and Big Hurt on Fox. He's called uh, Mets games forever, Tampa Bay Rays games. The guy's awesome. I mean, to be as a big of a – big of a, a – platform as he's on he's also super super nice that's what i love most about him all right he's a major stud in the broadcasting world he's kind enough to co-host our trivia contest tonight uh, if you're just joining us baseball trivia epic with kevin burkhart instagram live follow coach ball game me and kevin burkhart it's gonna be some cool questions speaking of trivia this baseball is from the 1986 world series it was given to me by Bennett Shields, who works at Play Ball. He gave me a box of 1986 World Series baseballs. Who won the 1986 World Series? Baby Ball Game says me. No, it was not. It was not you, Baby Ball Game. Who won the 1986 World Series? Correct answer is the Mets. First one to answer that is Jake Nadeau. Firestone's come in second place. 
Who did they beat? Who did the Mets beat in that World Series? Seven Jays is in the house. Nolan Ryan Jr., correct. And the fire, uh, yes, Firestones get it right with the Red Sox. They beat the Red Sox. The Mets have won two World Series. They won in 1969 with a guy named Tom Seaver. Uh, the manager was Gil Hodges. Ooh, that might be a question tonight at our trivia contest. But the Mets beat the Red Sox in the 1986 World Series. Epic stuff. Okay, back to your cones. And now we're going to go frog jumps over all 10 cones. And then we've got um, high knees. And then we've got push-ups. Okay, so follow me. At the beginning, on your marks, get set, frog jumps. Get that bee honk as low to the ground. Land on your toes so your head doesn't move. Land on your toes. Very good. Now we're high knees. Get the knees up as high as you can. And push-ups. Eight of them today. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Very nice. Water break. Water break after each set. We have to thank our most loyal sponsor, Dancing Water Break. Go ahead and do a little dance to the beat. Freeze. Very good. Round of applause. Team meeting pose. Staring contest. You and me. If you blink, you lose. Go! Good thing my shirt's tucked in. I'm not even close to blinking. I'm feeling good. And pause. Do a quick attaboy or an attagirl challenge with somebody in the room. What's an attaboy challenge? You just say attaboy back and forth to another boy. Or you say attagirl back and forth to another girl. I'll give you 12 more seconds to do that. At a girl. At a boy. Dad, at a girl, mom. And halt. Now it's countdown time. Loud as you can. Three, two, one. At a boy. Let me know who won. Let's go uh, set number two here. Back to the start of the cones. We got frog jumps, high knees, and push ups. On your marks, get set, go. Frog jump. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. If you want to make the sound of a frog, by all means. High knees. Ten of them each leg. Ten high knees each leg. And push ups. Eight of them. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One, and water break. After each set, do a water break. Firestones beat me. Ryman beat me. Champ Camp kids are in the house. Lando beat mom. Wow, Lando's mom getting the workout in also. Let's give Lando's mom in Washington an atta girl. One, two, three. Atta girl! Any other moms out there doing this? I recommend you just sit and drink your coffee in peace because you've probably got to be a uh, homeschool teacher for the rest of the day. You're getting a lot of Atta Girls on YouTube. Miss Oliphant, Lando's mom. Uh-oh. Jess beat me. Mustache salute, Jess. Ryman beat mom. Firestones beat me. Soto beat me as well. All right, round number three. One more. On your marks. Get set. Go. Frog jumps. Ribbit. Ribbit. Land on your toes. Every time you land, you want to feel like nobody can push you over. 
Same with your high knees. Have an athletic base underneath you every time your feet land. And push-ups. Anybody from SOCHH with us today? Southern California Homeschool? Let me know if you're with us today. And eight. Water break. Water break. Grandma Squeaky Cheeks is in the house. She's doing it as well. Numbers are up today. That fires me up. That means you guys are telling your friends. That means Giancarlo Stan, Firestones, Ryman, Nolan Ryan Jr., Jacob Noel, Jake Nadeau, Super Henry, Judge Jr., Soto, Lando, Penguin, Pickle. You guys are telling your friends. That fires me up. Grind till you're signed. This is a baseball lifestyle shirt, by the way. These guys are awesome. All right. It's time to thank our most loyal sponsor again. Dance to the beat. Dance. Freeze. What type of dances are going on out there? Are you guys still flossing? Anybody doing the Orange Justice? Anybody doing the tango? What about the mashed potato? Anybody doing the mashed potato? Anybody doing the twist? Very good. Three claps. One, two, three. All right. Uh, what I'd like you to do now is go ahead and set up your bases, home, first, second, and third, with your trash can in the middle. This is called Beat Coach Ball Game. Theme music. In this segment, you have an activity you have to do at each of the bases. After you do that activity, you've got to try to make your basket into the trash can. All right, this first go round is kangaroo hops, 10 kangaroo hops, and then you got to shoot your basket. Second base, same thing, kangaroo hops, 10 of them, shoot your basket. Same thing at third base, shoot your basket. And then same thing at home, shoot your basket. And the goal is to try to beat Coach Ball Game. Okay? On your marks. Get set. Go. Kangaroo. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shoot the basket. Yes. First base. Shoot the basket. Try to go all the way around the bases before coach ball game. Third base. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Anybody beat me on that one? I think Keegan Garrison did. Speedy's flossing, by the way. So is Penguin and Pick Pickle. Trivia tonight is 530 Pacific. And it's on my Instagram and my Facebook posted it there, 5.30 Pacific. Please tell everybody. Big trivia contest with a very famous broadcaster, Kevin Burkhart. Colby beat me. Giancarlo Stanton beat me. Penguin and Pickle beat me. Puppy Pro beat me. I love it. Whew. We're going to do that again. I'm going to try and beat you this time. Remember the kangaroo hop. You've got your baby in your pouch. And your paws right here, just like that. If you've got multiple people in the room, say Puppy Pro and Fireball are in the room right now, Puppy Pro start at one base, Catching Kitty start at the other, Fireball start at another, and just go around the loop like that. You're trying to go all the way around the loop before I do. On your marks, get set, go. Kangaroo, 10 of them, over the cone. Nine. Kangaroo hops. I tell you what, I'd want a kangaroo to be my uh, shortstop. 
They're super quick and they stay on their toes and they're very protective of their young. I want that kind of a ball player as my shortstop. Water break when you're done. I'm sweating a little bit. Jeff is in the house. Welcome. Super Henry tied me again. Me and Super Henry are on the same wavelength. He must tuck his shirt in. Rye man beat me. Soto beat me. Welcome in, T. Morgan. Uh-oh, Super Henry beat me. Pete Alonzo beat me. Pete Alonzo, are you in the... Uh, Washington, D.C.? Where are you guys at, Jimmy Bop? <sighs> Colby beat me again, my Lanta. Get a little water break. I want to ask a trivia question. Kind of get us warmed up for Tuesday Trivia Night. And this is how it'll work. On my Instagram Live, at Coach Ball Game, uh, I do trivia every Tuesday night, every Thursday night. Tune in on the Instagram Live. Tonight, 5.30 Pacific, 8.30 Eastern, and one of the questions I'm going to ask is, how many Gold Glove Awards does Nolan Arenado have? Who can guess? First one to get it right gets a mustache salute and a double bicep salute. <laughs> Soto beat me as well. Firestones have uh, put down every single number from 1 to 10, but it, they do not have the right one. Super Henry is super close. Still haven't seen the correct answer. Firestones guessed it correctly, as did Nolan Ryan Jr. with 7. Now, the Firestones guessed 2, then 4, then 3, then 5, then 4, and then 1. And then they guessed 7. Correct answer is 7. And I got to interview Nolan Arenado, one of the sweetest guys you'll ever meet. Uh, he grew up just down the road here, El Toro High School, Orange County. Let's give Nolan Arenado an attaboy. One, two, three. Attaboy. All right, back to the ball game. See if you can beat Coach Ballgame. Now we got a new activity. New activity. At each base, you've got to do a floss dance. One, two, three. 10 times. Now do it as fast as you can, but your hips have to go through your hands 10 times. On your marks, get set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Very nice. See that go a little faster. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Shoot the best. Like I got ants in my pants. Like I've got bumblebees in my pants. Whew. I am a quick flosser, I'll be honest. Katie, you are correct. Seven was the answer. That's right. Carlos Stanton beat me. Man, he must be a fast flosser. Way to go. Make sure you get a water break. Pickle and Penguin beat me. Good job, Jacob No Firestones. Get a water break. If you're a little out of breath, hands above your head. Deep breath in through the nose. Slowly out the mouth. Nice job, Soto. You are done as well. Very good. Okay, last one. See if you can beat me at this one. Each time you get to a base, you've got to do five sit-ups. On your marks, get set, go. One sit-up, two, three, four, five. Sit-ups. One. Five. 
Yes. One, two, come on, Puppy Pro, Fireball, Lando, Judge Jr., Knott's Berry Farm, Soto, Pickle, Penguin, Firestones, Jacob Knoll, Jake Nadeau, Speedy, Fitbit, Catching Kitty, Lando's Mom, Firestones Mom, Super Henry. Nice job. Giancarlo Stanton, Colby. Giancarlo's beat me. Pickle and Penguin beat me. BJ Allred's in the house. We are ER. Mustache salute. Rye man. Very nice. All right, get you a water break. This is when I try to name everybody here. All the nicknames. If I forget your nickname, I've got to do 10 jumping jacks per name with a box on my head. Get you a water break. Get you a water break, but this is the box. This is the box I'll have to put on my head and do jumping jacks for every name that I forget. All right. Let's start with Facebook. Pete Alonzo, Super Henry, Judge Jr., Penguin, Pickle. On uh, Instagram, Colby, Speedy, Giancarlo Stanton, BB Raiden, um, that's it. Firestones, Mom and Dad, Lando, um, Puppy Pro, Fireball, Soto, Jacob Knoll, Jake Nadeau, um, Catching Kitty, Fitbit, Blue Ninja, Rye Man, The Jones Family, which is Cupcake, Mm. I feel like I'm forgetting a few, and I've got to do 10 jumping jacks for whoever I didn't say. Go ahead. I know I said Rye Man, but if I did not call out your nickname, let me know. I called Jake Nadeau, Jacob Null. I said Jake Nadeau and Jacob Null. Wow. By the way, the Jones family is Cupcake, also known as Charlie Hustle, Rufus, and Jay Bell. Jay Bell, that's incredible. Is there anybody I didn't name? I might have gotten y'all. Soto, Puppy Pro. <laughs> Brad Pitt salute. Love it. Hey, I must have got you all. That means no jumping jacks with a box on my head. Is that for real? Love it. Um. Oh, yeah, Jacob Noah's Dinger. That's right, Dinger. Well, at least I said your name, but uh, I get confused. You and Jake Nadeau, uh, maybe you can change your your handle. Uh, two minutes of what a ball player does, and then we've got the seven. But first, two minutes of what a ball player does. Clean up, make your bed, clean the kitchen, clean up your toys, do something awesome. Katie, uh, I didn't even know Katie was there. Is that Giancarlo Stanton's sister? Katie, um, and do you have a nickname, Katie? All right, two minutes starts now. What a ball player does activity. All right, Soto's folding laundry. What's your favorite thing to do, Katie? That'll be your nickname. What's Blue Ninja doing? 
There you go. Starting the homework there. Puppy Pro. Good job. Judge Jr.'s bringing the garbage in recycling bins from the street. Got to have a nickname, guys. That way I can call them out. All right. One minute down, one to go. If you've finished your activity, go find something else. And bring back your notebooks because we're doing the seven. Fireball brush the dog. Way to go. Clean that dog. Blue Ninja writing an encouraging text message to a friend. Mustache salute. That's how you spread joy. Pickles doing some laundry. Sportsmanship salute. Anybody else doing some epic stuff? 15 seconds left. 15 seconds remaining. Five, four, three, two, and stop. Very good. Nolan Ryan Jr. I don't know if I said Nolan Ryan Jr. That is correct. That means I've got to do 10 jumping jacks with a box on my head because I forgot to say Nolan Ryan Jr. Now, he might have already left to go to school, but he was here this morning. So, 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, stop. And that'll be our newest segment. We'll do that every single uh, class where I'll try to name off everybody's nickname that's here. And if I mess up, I got to do that. All right. Raise of hands. Who's been graphing the data? Who's been graphing your data? Welcome in, Mason. Get you a tennis ball. We're going to do the seven. Anybody been graphing data? The seven J's made coffee for dad, by the way. Sportsmanship. Steel Metal is in the house. Welcome, Steel Metal. All right. The Firestones have been graphing their data. Love that. First one is high five the sky. You can use a glove or you can go bare hand. 60 seconds. On your marks, get set. Go. Go. Meet, squeeze, and freeze. High five this guy. That's it. Hum, baby. High five this guy. No cups of soup. We can't catch it like this. We got to go meet, squeeze, and freeze. Gotcha. Nolan Ryan Jr. has started his Zoom. Meet, squeeze, and freeze. High five this guy. Just like that. Boy, I'm giving that blue sky a nice high five, catching it above my head. Oh, that's right. Seven J's is speedy. Whew, man, I can't keep up with all those handles. Love it. Ten seconds remaining on the high five the sky. If you smile, you'll do it better. Barney Fife taught me that. Stop. All right, write that number down. And if you've already done some data graphing, boom, put a little dot on your graph. A little data. D. Hawthorne in the house. Mustache salute. Next drill, the wall drill. Tennis ball. Throw it against the wall. Meet it. Squeeze it. Meet it. Squeeze it. Meet it. Squeeze it. But don't forget to freeze it. On your march, get set, go. Can anybody beat Coach Balkin? Two. Cup of soup doesn't count. Four. Take the step towards the ball like a brave, mighty warrior. Six, seven, eight, nine. Soft hands. We're not jabbing at it. We're not swatting at it like a fly. Soft hands. Meet, squeeze, and freeze. Fingers to the sky. That's it. That's it. Absolutely. 15 seconds remaining. Come on, Judge Jr. Come on, Speedy. Come on, Firestones. Nolan Ryan Jr., Puppy Pro, Fireball, Blue Ninja, Soto, Pete Alonzo, Super Henry. 
Dinger, Jake Nadeau, Still Metal, Cupcake, Charlie Hustle, Freeze. Very good. Write that number down. Love it. Jones Family. Now, the Jones Family in Indianapolis, uh, are you the... Are you the folks that, that I grew up with in North Carolina? Just type that in. If uh, I, my, my brain is just clicking, I'm thinking, who do I know in Indianapolis? Let me know if that's you. Did you grow up in North Carolina with me, and then you moved to Indianapolis? Drill number three is the alligator. Fielding triangle, glove on the ground, and then smack the alligator mouth. On your marks, get set, go! Alligator. Once again, glove on the ground first and adjust up if you need to. Soft hands. At our sandlot today, three Pacific, six Eastern, we're going to be working on defense. We're going to be working on our defensive skills. And guess who's showing up tomorrow to the sandlot? Major League Baseball pitcher Rowan Wick pitches for the Cubs, throws 100 miles an hour. He's going to be our guest teacher at the Sandlot. You should all be there. Every weekday, I do the Sandlot. I hope you show up. You literally just need your computer. And you watch. 15 seconds remaining. Five seconds. and stop. Write that number down. I've got to repeat that. That's such huge news. Today at the Sandlot, we're working ground balls and defense. Tomorrow, Wednesday Sandlot, 3 Pacific, 6 Eastern, on my YouTube, a Major League Baseball pitcher is going to join us and teach us how to coach. Rowan Wick throws 100 miles an hour. He's going to teach us how to pitch. He's not going to teach us how to coach. He's going to coach me. Blue Ninja loves the alligator drill. That makes a lot of sense right there, Catherine. <laughs> awesome. Wow. England turned Jones. Love me some England family. Outstanding. And Coach Jones, double bicep salute to you, good sir. Thank you for being a baseball coach. Drill number four. Soccer juggling. Soccer juggling. We talked about this yesterday. Some of these drills are meaner than others. Um, uh, this one's mean to me. I don't do very well with this one. But I can either let it bury me and make me feel sad, or I can uh, let it fuel me and fire me up. Give me a little determination. On your marks, get set, go. One, two, I got three. I got three on that. I got four. I got five. I got two. I got five again. I'm getting better at this. Woo! Oh! Six! You can use any body part except your hands. Be honkus, chest, knee, leg. Sandlot, three Pacific, six Eastern, every weekday. Sandlot, three Pacific, six Eastern, every weekday. And stop. I love it. We've got fellow Carolinians saying hello to each other. Mama Becky and Catherine Camille. Write that number down. Graph it. Graph the data. And I need you to tell me what's number five. Firestone's got 12 in a row, by the way. What's the fifth drill? I need to make sure you're still paying attention. Stay with me. By the way, I had a video sent to me from one of our uh, ball players, Soto, and he's been getting stronger. His muscles are getting bigger, and he's been getting faster. So let's give Soto in Missouri 
An attaboy. One, two, three. Attaboy! All right, 12 in a row from the Firestones. Figure eight is correct. My Firestone boys are paying attention. Figure eight on your marks, get set. Go! Through the legs. Be honkus low to the ground. That's it. Figure eight. That's right, Blue Ninja. You're paying attention. Megan Clap in the house. If you need a photographer, go talk to Meg. She's epic. Is that Megan Clap? The Megan Clap? Like Tyler Clap's Megan Clap? Or is that a different one? Through the leg, you go. Figure eight, says Speedy. Good job. My legs are getting sore. Oh, is Tyler doing this right now? Is he doing the figure eight? Hey, T-Bone, you and Michael Cole doing this right now? And Wild Man Wilkie? And Mickey Burgess? And Ross Houston? And Derek Collins? And stop. Very good. Whew. Deep breath in through the nose, out the mouth. Write your number down, graph your data. Number six, hula hoop. On your marks, get set, go. How many of these can you get in 60 seconds? When I was a kid, I had a poster on my uh, bedroom wall of Michael Jordan. He could do this 60 times in 40 seconds. I always wanted to be like Mike. And a girl, Meg. Judge Junior, can you beat me? Firestones, Jake Nadeau, Dinger, Speedy, Soto, Ryman. Forgot to start my watch. I think we probably got about 15 more seconds left. Still Metal, Cupcake, Nolan Ryan Jr., Lando, Super Henry. Woo, stop. Wow, that was tough. Now, the ping pong drill is the seventh. Today, we're going to switch it up a little bit. It's still ping pong, but it's with a volleyball or a beach ball or anything you might have. But how do you hit a volleyball? One hand out, the other hand right on top of it. I love the sound of that, by the way, that smack. And then you bring your thumbs in, boom, and you're hitting it right here, bumping it up in the air, just like Catherine Jones did in school, right? Bang, boom, on your marks. 60 seconds, how many can you get? Go. One, volleyball, three. Oh, I used my hand. One, two, three, four. Ping pong with a beach ball. Hand-eye coordination. You can't stand still. Your feet have to be fluid. Stay active. Stay on your toes. Ah. Stay with it. Keep ping-ponging. Global freeze in the house. Mustache salute. That's right. My drum set. It's always here with me. 20 seconds to go on the volleyball. Ping pong. That's it. 10 seconds remaining. And stop. Write that number down. Great job today at our PE class. Please don't forget um, about all the exciting stuff happening. Um, Speedy's up and running. Very good. You got the YouTube to work. Um, three o'clock today is Sandlot. 5.30 today is Epic Trivia. And the winner gets to host with me the following Tuesday. And by the way, our guest host tonight is Kevin Burkhart. He's an NFL and an MLB broadcaster for Fox Sports. And he'll be our guy. Uh, there'll be some A-Rod trivia, some big poppy trivia. You got it, Soto. Please tune in. And tomorrow's Sandlot is with Rowan Wick, the closer for the Chicago Cubs. 
he's kind enough to join us. And that'll be on Instagram Live, and I'll simulcast it on my YouTube as well. Um, any questions from anybody before you take off? Great job by Speedy. Great job, Ryman. Soto. Great job, Will Carden. Global Freeze. Great job, Judge Jr. Super Henry. Pete Alonzo. Pickle. Penguin. Lando. SpongeBob Landry. Great job, uh, Grandma Squeaky Cheeks. Mom. Dad. Blue Ninja. Steel Metal. Puppy Pro. Fireball. Dinger. Jake Nadeau. Cupcake. Charlie Hustle. J Bell. Great job, everybody. Nolan Ryan Jr. I think I got everybody's shout out in. Awesome job today, folks. Many thanks. Indeed. Indianapolis. Tell your dad to tune in to uh, trivia tonight if he can. He'll probably enjoy the baseball trivia. Toby. And your brother, of course. Coach Brian. That's right. The winner of tonight's trivia contest will get to host with me the following Tuesday. It's going to be epic. You're going to want to tell all your friends. I mean, the guy who's hosting with me works with A-Rod and Big Poppy. Pretty cool. Mom, love you. Thanks. Any other questions? Don't forget to tune in. Weekdays for my Sandlot. Today we're working on defense. We're getting better at baseball. Thanks, Grandma Squeaky Cheeks in the house. Thanks, everybody. Awesome. To the ball game, take me out with a crowd. Buy me some peanuts and crack good chats. I don't care if I never get back for his food. for the cubbies if they don't win, it's a shame. Or it's one, two, three strikes around. never sounded better in your life. That's for you, Harry. Thought you'd like that. Bye-bye.